for coming for this first uh, conference. Let's start with the uh, players first. Um, we already talked a bit, Christian, at the end of the game, but um, was uh, an excellent game from Liga Ploki. Yes, it was. Tonight, um, how would you describe it as a player? Um, it was just very free-flowing, and um, we all had each other's backs. Uh, we were all defending, um, being smart offensively. We were blocking well, um, serving well. So I think just as a collective whole, um, everything was just had a good rhythm. Mm -hmm. Third win in a row, so you have kind of turned things around as, as a team. Uh, is there a... Uh, special reason for that or is it just a collective thing? Um, I don't think anything special. I think it's not a surprise to us. We know what we're capable of, um, but I think we're kind of figuring things out as a group and that's helping push us forward. Um, but we know that we're capable of doing this. So, mm. Your first season as a pro. Yeah. Um, how do you like it? I like it. It's different, but the experience is great and the players are awesome. So I love it. Thanks. Well, then we have a very experienced <laughs> volleyball lady next to you. But uh, you've been in all kinds of situations during your career, right? How do you need, how do you see the situation with Lenta Lenta Power Girl right now? At the moment, uh, I think my opinion we need just to have patience. So, mm -hmm. because uh, season is long, so it can happen. So and still maybe we take uh, ritmo, we take uh, or condition. So, but I want to say we have good team potential, with big really potential. Just maybe I need to have a little patience, so because mm -hmm. important how, how you finish. Yeah, you said that before, and I believe you. That is true. But now, to be honest, five losses in a row. So something needs to be done. As a very experienced player. Uh, what are the uh, means to make things better? Yes, uh, I understood every player because now at the moment maybe a little hard mentally. So because, how you say it, we lose five games. But I believe in the team, in the job what we're doing, in the practice. So on, and I know soon it will be too much better. Okay. Thank you, uh, Vera. Thank you, Kristin. If you ladies want to you know, I want to thank you very for the And uh, thanks a lot. So we shall continue with the coaches. And uh, in first, uh, as a coach, I believe you're pretty happy with the way things went to tonight. Uh, how would you comment? Yeah, uh, for sure. It's uh, it's very rare when you play a game when everything is working. Uh, Kristen said it herself that we're doing well in all aspects of the game and it's very rare. Often you maybe be good in serving and blocking and then you then your offense is not that good but, but today everything is working. So it may seem like in the score that it was easy win but it was for sure not easy at all because um, Hamilton has a very good team and I said that also after we played them first time at our home court that I believe they were going to be top team in the league and I still do that because there are a lot of good uh, players on that team. So uh, it was a very great win for us today but like Veda said the season is long so there's many many more matches to be played. Exactly, it's only one third of the regular yeah. season is now, now played. But anyhow, you have kind of as a team Turn things around. Now three. You had some losses. Now you have won three in a row. As a coach, um, what's your uh, explanation or analysis for that? I think there was one little uh, loss in between. Ah, okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> but, uh, but sorry. Three out of four. Yeah. Um, but I think it's it's about what what Kristen said that we're starting to figure out like how we're gonna prepare for matches, how we're gonna practice. What are the the players' strength on the court and how we play together? I think that's what we are we're starting to figure out, um, and it's it's good that it's happening now because uh, it after the first matches with few losses and I can I can uh, I can understand the feeling of the Hamilton players that it's uh, it's very hard to lose and it was also hard on us so 
thankfully we turned things around now, so we hope to, to keep going. Okay, thank you, Kim. Uh, Giovanni, you've been in all kinds of situations yes. throughout your career. Yeah. And I, I know that. Uh, with that experience, uh, how would you describe this situation? Well, Where you uh, so we struggle now in the uh, quite of self confidence things. And then our line passing is uh, don't work in the proper way, does affect uh, most of uh, the game. And uh, so we don't have an uh, easy inside out because we don't have the ball. Uh, we have maybe one on ten ball on the first two meters, so mm -hmm. that's it's, uh, not easy to play, you know. And when you have to s try to score and uh, find the energy for that, you can't because you need also the rhythm of, uh, of that thing. So. And uh, like also not Olivera, but also the other players say. So we have a quality of work on uh, training a lot. Uh, we missing something that is uh, clear. Mm -hmm. So and uh, we are too looking for these kind of things. So that's first of all. In your mind, also too it's injury now. Exactly. So and then we have to uh, find uh, a player that can. Uh, can not solve the, the problems because nobody alone solve the problems. But as a team, then maybe it's uh, the good way. And also the season is long, like you know. So uh, the medals in April is not in November. That is that is uh, true. Uh, you have a game, another home game yeah. coming up on on yeah. Saturday. Uh, so you have two days to get there. Yeah, but in, I, I say so. The, the team. Uh, 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 at least, uh, okay. The first two set was uh, like in panic, but then uh, uh, after the uh, the break, they reacted in some way. Uh, they don't then um, they don't win the set as uh, they try in the maximum effort mm -hmm. that we have in this moment. It's not a big issue on, uh, about the, if you have, if we have uh, less training because uh, um, you see also that we change some system inside of the passing line to have a different way to play. Uh, I think that's come and work in the future also. Uh, we have to find some uh, some extra energy in uh, our skills also as player, as team, mm -hmm. and uh, be brave and uh, going for that. So that's uh, uh, it's the thing. So of course it's difficult, but it's normal when you lost games and, uh, and that's his uh, things. Yeah. Is there anything else, Kim, that you would like to add? It was great to see uh, so many people in the, in the gym. It's really uh, I, I was I was not here before. It was really a nice place. I was saying a lot of people. Always nice to play places like that. How about you, Johnny? Something else on your mind? I just want to say that the team have energy and they're still alive. So that's is uh, the most important thing for uh, for our uh, our team. So and I'm pretty sure that they soon uh, the work that we're doing uh, will uh, come out. Let's hope so. Yeah. I work for Land of Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.